Knowledge is the key to freedom. But the key to knowledge got to be checked carefully. I used to think that knowledge was power. That's not necessarily true. Because you can learn the wrong thing. Jesus said the only thing that can set you free is not knowledge, but knowledge of the truth. It's dangerous to learn the wrong thing well. Some people are experts in error. Come on, talk to me. <laughs> so knowledge doesn't mean you're smart, because what you may have learned may not be true. And the most dangerous thing for a person to have is knowledge that is erroneous that they believe is true. The most dangerous human being I've ever met is one who has zealous error. People with zeal who are wrong. And it's the cause of great tragedy in our humanity and in our history of man. Most of the problems in our past are results of zealous, erroneous people. People who had information that was erroneous, it was wrong, but they thought it was right and they were zealous. Hitler, for example, believed that everybody else was subhuman and the Aryan race was the only true human race. And that error made him massacre millions of people. The crusaders who were Christians were under an error and they killed thousands and thousands of people all over Europe because they had a theological error and tried to force people to come to Jesus with the sword. And then you used to preach against speaking in tongues and you used to rebuke people who did it and now you're doing it more than they. Don't look at me so funny. Some of you used to have scriptures to prove it was from the devil. Look at you now. It's amazing what we do with error. We defend it vehemently. That's why Jesus said, knowledge of the truth shall set you free. Not just knowledge, but the truth. Now I mentioned to you that truth, the key to truth is who? The manufacturer. What do I mean by that? The manufacturer is the only one who knows the truth about his product. Let me try it one more time. <laughs> the manufacturer is the only one who knows the truth about his product. Yes. Everybody else is experimenting. Come on up. That's good. Everybody else is guessing. And everybody else has opinions. The manufacturer knows the truth about his product. That's why you shouldn't get information from anyone else except the manufacturer. Don't even believe the retailer because he's in business for sales. Lord, help me tonight. That's why I don't trust humans to tell me who I am. Don't depend on customer's experience to determine the value of a product because some customers don't know how to use it. You all are slow here tonight. Me, many of us have literally allowed people to talk us out of good products because they abused it and it didn't work for them. Not because your marriage didn't work doesn't mean marriage doesn't work. Hello. You just didn't know how to stay married. You didn't follow the manufacturer's manual. You didn't follow the specifications. Hello, somebody. So if the toaster didn't work for you, that doesn't mean the toaster ain't no good. You just plugged it in wrong. 
Are you understanding me? The truth about a product is only hid in the mind of the manufacturer. That's why manufacturers love for you to have their address. You're going to get this after I'm gone. <laughs>